It's the Live Music Showcase on WMNF Tampa. Hey, everybody. I'm Bill Dudley. It's another great music show we got for you today. Francesca Ani is our guest on today's show. She's an up-and-coming singer-songwriter. We're going to have her doing a bunch of her tunes. Hey, welcome to the show. Hello. Thank you for having me. Why don't you start us off with a song and tell us what it's going to be first, please. Awesome. Well, this song is... Well, this first song is going to be the first song released off of my next EP, and it's called Kaleidoscope. If you stay, I will let you change my last name if you want to. We're one in the same. They say the finer things in life are made for two. Let's leave the world tonight, cause with you I'm alive. I see the northern lights in those emerald eyes. There's no place like you, there's no place like home. We'll show the world tonight that our love's a kaleidoscope. Oh, oh, oh. follow chase the stars till tomorrow we can go far enough where no one will find us hearts on fire burning bright i leave the world tonight cause with you i'm alive i see the northern in those emerald eyes There's no place like you There's no place like home We'll show the world tonight That our love's a kaleidoscope Oh, 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 oh. I see a when I'm riding by your side in the passenger seat In your voice I hear symphonies And our late night talks down by the beach I see a million possibilities When I'm riding by your side in the passenger seat I never felt so close When you whisper to me our inside jokes Let's leave the way In those emerald eyes There's no place like you There's no place like home We'll show the world tonight That our love's a kaleidoscope Oh, 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 oh A kaleidoscope <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Francesca Ani, our guest on today's live music showcase from WMNF. Hey, everybody. Welcome into the show. Francesca, tell us a little bit about you. Well, hello, everybody. My <laughs> name is Francesca Ani. I am an indie pop singer-songwriter from Tampa, Florida. All right. And Ani, well, let's spell your name out because uh, folks might want to check you out on your website, which is francescaani.com. And that is spelled F R A N C E S C A. Ani is spelled A N I. Yeah. Dot com. Yeah, dot com. <laughs> uh, by the way, before we go any further, I want to tell you you can watch this show on TV 
uh, on Facebook. All you got to do is go to Facebook and type in LMS WMNF. That'll get you there. We're streaming right now on Facebook. Give us a like, sign up, whatever you need to do. Support this radio show. Yeah, this is WMNF Community Radio, for those of you that might have just tuned in. Tonight, uh, our uh, YouTube producer, uh, Dr. Richard Stone, will uh, have our show up on uh, YouTube. And you can check that out at <clears throat> youtube.com slash WMNF885FM. So, how did you get started picking and singing? So, it actually all started with piano. When I was five years old, my aunt gifted us her old piano that was not used anymore and I started playing with my little itty bitty five-year-old hands <laughs> <laughs> and I loved it so much and I really wanted to learn how to play guitar because one Taylor Swift was becoming big then oh yeah and you know eight-year-old me loved Taylor Swift uh, you know what 18 year old me still loves Taylor Swift <laughs> but <laughs> that was one reason and then another reason was because you can't like take your piano to a bonfire with you you know yeah, what i mean it's harder, not yeah. <laughs> not super portable but it is still very fun so then santa gave me a guitar for christmas one year and i just started playing and singing wow. and writing songs and being happy oh, that's great what a great story <laughs> So who were your influences at this time besides Taylor? Besides Taylor, we've got the Beatles. My dad was always a huge Beatles fan. Oh, good, and my good. you know, my phone, all the space and all my data is used up with the Beatles music, but that's okay. Yeah. And Eva Cassidy has been a huge influence vocally. Eva she's, Cassidy? She's amazing. Really? Wow. I've favorite. never heard anybody say that they they even listened to Eva Cassidy. She's a, a gal who uh, died very young, but lived in, uh, came from Washington, D.C. area, right? Mm -hmm. And just Much recorded some gorgeous albums. And if anybody out there doesn't know who Eva Cassidy was, I suggest you check her out. We should be friends if you like Eva Cassidy. Yeah. I'd like to be friends I, with I do you. love her. She, is, she, <laughs> she was wonderful. It's just too bad she, she left us so early. But anyway, let's have another song cool. from Francesca Ani. Awesome. Well, this next one is my personal favorite off of this next EP, and it's called Lie to Me. Thousand miles from your body, meet me halfway. If you want me to stay If you think I'm gonna choose Between my life and you You wouldn't like the truth You can come along if you're gonna treat me right No, I don't have the time to fight I'm not a little girl who's afraid of the big world No, you're not gonna get in my way My heart's not a toy and my mind ain't a game And even if it were, I didn't ask you to play Why you gotta lie, why you gotta lie to me When you change every day, it ain't funny to me I'm so easy to break and I hate watching you leave why you gotta lie to me? Why you gotta lie? Why you gotta lie? Why you gotta lie to me? Can't you see what you're doing? You're killing me with your dishonesty. said you'd be part of my dreams answer my prayers but you couldn't share needed your support but my feelings were ignored and you wanted me all to yourself i'm not a little girl who's afraid of the big world no you're not gonna get in my way my heart's not a toy and my mind ain't a game and even if Ask you to play why you gotta lie why you gotta lie to me when you change every day it ain't funny to 
of me I'm so easy to break and I hate watching you leave Why you gotta lie to me? Why you gotta lie? Why you gotta lie? Why you gotta lie to me? I remember you were better I let you in Couldn't handle went to battle sinking my shield And now I'm swimming ashore This isn't fun anymore My heart's not a toy My mind's in a game Even if I were I didn't ask you to play How you gotta lie When you change every day, it ain't funny to me I'm so easy to break and I hate watching you leave Leave me Why you gotta lie, why you gotta lie Why you gotta lie to me, yeah Why you gotta lie, why you gotta lie Why you gotta lie to me Francesca Ani, our guest on today's live music showcase here from WMNF. I want to shout out to thanks to all our, our great live music showcase crew. Mark Perfetti behind the glass there, mixing it all up today. Woo-hoo. Today he's assisted by Joe Remo and Lee Cook on the electronic side of things. We've got our great TV crew. crew. We've got Bob Hoke uh, doing the directing here. And we've got Marcy and Tom Connors on cameras, along with Richard Stone, who also uh, produces our YouTube uh, uh, our YouTube channel. We've got a great YouTube channel. We've got all our old shows on there going back like years. <laughs> yeah, some really good ones too. And uh, check that out at youtube.com slash 88, WMNF 885FM is the uh, keyword there. And you can watch us right now on Facebook. <clears throat> Excuse me, go to facebook.com and it's LMS WMNF. LMS, WMNF. Steve Ardwenga, our show producer, is in the control room here at WMNF. If you want to talk to him with reactions or comments or questions, you can give him a call at 813-239-9663 or send him a little email, dj at wmnf.org. That'll go right, go directly into the control room. Any other time, if you've got somebody you want to get on the show or you yourself might want to be on the show. You can bring it to our attention by sending us an email at livemusic at wmnf.org. That's the only address you'll need to, uh, to get on the live music showcase. We've got some great shows coming up too. So uh, anyway, so you said your influences were people from Taylor Swift to the Beatles? Are there some people in between those two <laughs> that were your uh, influences? <laughs> I mean, there's honestly... Well, I mean like... You know, Joni Mitchell or? Well, I would, I just name them as my real, my top three influences because they're honestly my favorites. I like to take Eva Cassidy, like her vocalistic style and how pure and honest her music was Mm -hmm. and then mix it with kind of Taylor Swift's songwriting abilities, which are, you know, they're killer. Mm -hmm. And the Beatles just were not afraid to experiment. You know what I mean? Yeah. And they just, they had everything they could ever want. And they were able to just make the coolest songs. Anything from like, I am the walrus. I used to sing that at school and people were like, okay. Because they didn't know that song. (laughs) They never heard that. (laughs) (laughs) I think they might have thought it was mine. Oopsies. (laughs) Well, uh, Francesca, you got a website, francescaani.com. People can find out. Uh, You've got one EP out. Yes. Um, And available at the usual places. All the usual places. All the usual places, yeah. (laughs) Yep, yep, yep. And a new one coming out uh, this year sometime. Yes. Now, EP in this case means what? Uh, Five songs? Four four. songs? Four songs, okay. Um, The one that's already out has three songs. Uh And the one that's coming out has four. Okay. Moving up in the world. You got plans on uh, videos and stuff like that? Yes, I do. I release videos anywhere from two to four a month on my YouTube channel, so you can check that out is just Francesca Ani on YouTube. Okay. And I usually also put the audio for those videos on distribution distribution services. So like you'll be able to hear the audio on Spotify, iTunes, Amazon, all that. All cool the good stuff. stuff. Okay. And Francesca is spelled F R A N C E S C A 
A N I dot com. Dot com. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we're happy to have you on the show today. Thank you so much for having me. You yeah. guys were so sweet. I just kind of emailed in, not thinking I could get on that easily. And you were so welcoming and open, and everyone here is so sweet. Well, and it's 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 just really nice to have, you know, uh, a younger artist coming, on, coming in the show. We've got all different kinds of people come on the show, of course. That's the coolest so, part yeah, about it. Yeah, so. Well, do us another song. Cool. So, um... This song is actually the name of my last EP. It's the title, and it is called Open Your Arms. I swear it's not you. Might be what you said I did or wanted to do. Maybe it's just me, but things they aren't so perfect like they used to be. All the way we used to see your hand on my waist and my lipstick all over your face and our hearts beating fast, but we weren't made to last. You are. Baby, open your arms again and let me go. We were great. At one point or another, we fell out of place. And you wanted more than I could ever give you and now I'm not so sure we even fit anymore I still see your hand on my waist and my lipstick all over your face and our hearts beating fast but we weren't made to live Francesca Ani, our guest on today's live music showcase from WMNF. 
While we're at it, we'd like to thank D Drum, located and made right here in Tampa, for donating the drum kit that we use often in our live music studio. We've got it right there in the drum room. You can find out more about them at ddrum.com. So, Francesca, where do the songs come from? Uh, personal experience? Some of them do. Some of them are personal experience. Some of them are stuff that I've seen my friends go through, like the next song that I'm going to play is something that my friend went through, not me. But I still wrote about it because I was there, I was witnessing it. Sometimes I have dreams and songs come out of that. Sometimes I watch TV shows. Songs are revealed. Yeah. It's, <laughs> I don't complain. I don't ask. I just let it happen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you find that songs sometimes take on a life of their own when you're in the middle of writing them? They really do. I've had a lot of times when I sat down with the intent to write, like, write a happy song, don't write a breakup song, and then it just, that's not what it wants to do. Mm -hmm. And sometimes, there's a great book called The Writing Life by Annie Dillard, and she even mentions how the stories take a life of their own, and they really just, you let them grow, and you help them grow, and it turns out to be what you need it to be, and then you edit when you yeah. have to. What if it takes a turn that, that you don't that you're not happy with what do you do then you just let it go and see what happens I usually I'll leave it for anywhere from a month to three years <laughs> and then I'll come back to it later with fresh eyes a cleared mind and see what else can come well, when, I write wh it. when was it that you actually started writing these songs um so technically I started writing songs when I was in kindergarten and they were mainly just lists of my friends names that I would sing but you real sing, song. Wait a minute, you sing names <laughs> to your friends? Why not? Well, I loved okay. them. Yeah. I loved them, and I was like, I'm going to put you in a song because I love you so much. But, you know, it evolved. These songs didn't have a whole lot of plot, though. Not a ton. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it happens. But do, do you real remember songs any? Can you sing one of those 10. songs? Can you sing one of those songs for us? <laughs> I don't think I remember them. I actually found my old, my old kindergarten song book two days ago really and it was all these names of people who i actually don't remember yeah that's a long time ago. <laughs> i don't remember anything about kindergarten either okay good i'm not <laughs> the only one <laughs> you're a little closer to it than me but <laughs> nevertheless <laughs> but so so then when you started you but how old were you or when did you start actually writing fully developed songs that have about a beginning and middle in years there? old i was about 10. uh-huh and they were actually mostly written on piano because that was my main instrument and I didn't know what to do with the guitar. But eventually I learned how to transpose and then I would just, um, just started writing songs on the guitar. Mm -hmm. Was it hard making the transition? Not really. I just, I loved music and I wanted to play music. So yeah. even if it was difficult, I didn't, that didn't stop me at all. I just wanted to do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, your guitar playing is, is pretty evolved. I mean, you've got some interesting Thanks. things that you're doing there. Thank you. And I, and I like the, the, use, the way you're using your pedals. That's really cool. It's fun. Which Pedal. What, what is that machine that you're using there? Which this one is, is that? This is the TC Helicon Play Acoustic. Uh -huh. um, it works really well. I've been using it for about, so I've had it for two years, and I've been using it for about a year. And it's pretty fun. Yeah. That's cool. Well, <laughs> sing us a song. Cool. So, as I said, this next one is actually about something that one of my friends went through, and it's called Late Night Ghosts, also on the next EP. falling Then you spoke to my soul How was I to know You were the one needing saving But you just couldn't trust me Your eyes were always watching Your presence still haunting me Late night ghosts make me wanna hold 
hold you close But I'd rather be alone than keep fighting So let me leave Don't blame me for anything We can't fix it even though we were trying I'll keep fighting these late night ghosts Every day you would say what I'm doing wrong But I was trying carry on I just wanted to breathe and to be happy without your permission yeah. but you just couldn't trust me your eyes were always watching your presence still haunting me late night make me wanna hold you close but I'd rather be alone than keep fighting so let me leave don't blame me for anything we can't fix it even though we were trying I'll keep fighting fight like this we can't love like this we can't grow like this i can't cry like this i can't live like this i can't stay like this i can't stand late night ghosts that make me want to hold you close but i'd rather be alone and keep fighting so let me leave don't blame me for anything we can't fix it even though we were trying and i'll keep fighting these late night goals Francesca Ani. She's our guest on today's live music showcase from WMNF in Tampa. I'm Bill Dudley. Welcome to the show, everybody. You can watch it live on Facebook at uh, LMS WMNF. If you're watching live, send us a like. Also, we'll be on YouTube tonight. This, this uh, show will, along with all of our last year or two or three of shows here. You can watch them all at Facebook.com. Just type in WMNF885FM, and thanks to Richard Stone, our YouTube producer, for making that possible. We have our own YouTube channel, and it's a great one, full of some great shows. Awesome. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, we'd like, like to uh, credit Mark Perfetti for mixing it today, assisted by Joe Remo and Lee Cook. That's responsible for the great audio that you're, that you're listening to right now with your ears. <laughs> So are you are you in currently in school? You're going to Yeah. So I am in college right now. I'm in Berkeley College of Music and I graduated high school in May. Oh, okay. So but that's up in New York, isn't it? Or it's in Boston, but I Boston. do it I'm online. At <laughs> it's they're close. They're both cold right yeah. now. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> but I do it online so that I can travel and sing and How does that work? You have you do like a Skype thing with your instructor? Um, sometimes they do have points where the entire class can actually video chat with each other. Mm -hmm. But a lot of it is just reading online and doing the assignments. Uh huh. It's fun. So you're learning uh, music theory and composition and stuff like that? No, I actually tested out of the music theory because I didn't want to spend my money on music theory because I've been doing 
I was classically trained in piano. So you already know a lot of that. I know I know enough. Yeah. I know enough. <laughs> yeah. I don't know yeah. everything. I d definitely not. But yeah, so I'm doing a lot of Pro Tools classes, songwriting, just, uh, what else? Marketing. So fun you can record like your that. own CDs. Yeah. And sell them or your own music. Your own music. I don't know. That's the idea. You probably are not really interested in making an actual CD, though. I mean, that's sort of. Um, I find that personally, for me, my singles do way better than even my EPs. Um, and, I they're, and they're and they're online. We're talking about online. Online, so yeah, <laughs> yeah, single. So so people um, so people buy your singles. Well, actually, my one of my cover songs I did "Say You Won't Let Go" by James Arthur, mm -hmm. and I did a cover of that, and I actually shot the video up in New York. Mm -hmm. And on Spotify, it did really well. It got put on a playlist in the Philippines, Discover Weekly, um, something else. And it that has done super well, and I still have a lot of streams on that every day. And it, I recorded it over a year ago. I put it out over a year ago. Wow. So, so. it's really important that somebody like you uh, in, in your, your generation, your age bracket kind of thing, with your audience, which I presume is a lot of people in your same in your same generation, right? Yeah. Would you, would you say? Well, it, it you or know not. it all depends on what social platform we're talking about. On Instagram, I have a lot of like teenagers and twenty somethings, but my Facebook is actually mainly forty through sixty. Really? My Facebook fans, yeah. Wow. Huh. Well, anyway, so what I was what I was starting to say was, uh, it's really important that in this day and age that you really are on top of your social media stuff. Yeah, it's all it's always there. Actually, fun fact: I did share this live stream onto my social media. So if you're watching from there, you That's know, great. go ahead and like that and <laughs> let me know that you heard me talk about you. Thank yeah. you for watching. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Francesca Ani, our guest on today's Live Music Showcase, she spells that F-R-A-N-C-E-S-C-A-A-N-I. And you can do all one word and put a dot com on that. Check out her, check out her very own website. She's also uh, at The One and Ani. <laughs> Came up with that one myself. <laughs> yeah, very clever, very clever. Well, you're supposed to be clever. You're a songwriter. Oh, I'm supposed to be clever, yeah. Again, that's a theoretically sort of situation. Well, but. <laughs> you know, now a lot of your songs are about love and angst and yes. breaking up and stuff like that. That is correct. Do you, do you plan on branching out a little bit as life goes on? I do. I have a song that actually I'm playing on the Florida Folk Show tomorrow morning. And I was there with Grant Peoples about two months ago, and they told me when I write a song about Florida... I can come back. Okay. And I wrote a song about Florida, and I'm going back tomorrow. That's great. Well, we'll so. have to tune in. That's at 9 <laughs> o'clock, I think, in the morning, yes. tomorrow morning here on MNF. Well, do us another song not about Florida then. <laughs> and uh, maybe next time you come on the show, you'll have a whole bunch of Florida songs. Maybe. You never know. You write a song about alligators or... Alligators. <laughs> no, alligators. Or oranges or oranges. Pythons. I can do that. <laughs> the Everglades in general. Yeah. Okay. Well, this song... Actually, the inspiration for this song is my guitar. This is my baby. She comes everywhere with me, meaning the guitar. I've taken her on so many airplanes. I've fought with a lot of flight attendants, a lot of flight attendants who didn't want me to bring my it's guitar. It's a struggle, I hear. It is, but <clears throat> legally, I'm allowed to bring it. So I, I bring I, the legal papers with me. I flew to uh, Nashville one time, and I had to go on four different planes, you know, because you change in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. And each time they did something different with my guitar. Each one of those four flights was so totally different. <laughs> oh, was, they tried to check my guitar. I was a nervous wreck. <laughs> yeah, it's scary. It's nerve wracking. But this is my baby. And so and it's a Taylor guitar. We don't so. check it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so I wrote a song called Taylor and it's kind of a play on words. So yeah, you'll hear it. Blinds affection, no direction. You always find a way to come back to me. Building me up with your crescendo, it drop me flat and leave me at a tune. 
So don't play on my heartstrings if you can't sing along with me, with me. Taylor, you're a player, but I love ya. I can't get ya off my fingertips, but I don't wanna pick you. But Taylor, you're a player, and I hate ya. I can't get ya off my fingertips. Tips, boy. Now I'm a player on my tailor like la da 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 oh da 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 oh yeah. Tunnel vision, quick decision. The colors blur to gray when you run from me. Taylor, trust me one. Cup of coffee and a quarter two from you can get me to go. So don't play on my heartstrings if you can't sing along with me, with me. Taylor, you're a player, but I love ya. I can't get ya off my fingertips, boy. Taylor, you're a player, and I hate ya. I can't get ya off my fingertips, boy. Now I'm a player on my Taylor like la da 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 da, oh da 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 da, oh yeah. So don't play on my heartstrings if you can't sing along with me. You're a player, but I love ya. I can't get ya off my fingertips, but I don't wanna pick you. But Taylor, you're a player, and I hate ya. I can't get ya off my fingertips, boy. Now I'm a player on my Taylor, like la da da na 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 on oh, la da. I'm a player, I'm a tailor like. <laughs> That's a fun one. Yeah, all your songs <laughs> kind of just end. <laughs> they do? Oh, I guess they do. <laughs> well, I mean, they, they sort of surprise me when they end. That's what I should have said. But I guess that's sort of the way it's done nowadays, right? I, I guess. We don't like I'm all lot, about surprises. We, we don't like a lot of big flourishy endings on songs anymore. I guess I've noticed that lately. It's kind of <laughs> hard to be flourishy when you're by yourself yeah i mean sometimes when i do play with a band we'll like kind of add in the end do some solos do some cool stuff but it's hard to get those other guys to shut up you know <laughs> <laughs> they just want to keep playing oh, no 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 <laughs> so do you get to play with bands very much um sometimes it really depends what i'm doing and it depends what kind of event i'm doing i did a show at waterworks park mm -hmm. when uh Wow, I don't even know when that was. But I did I did play with like a drummer and a bass player and it was super fun and everyone was upbeat. But then there's also other things where I just it's so much easier to just pick up my guitar and go. Yeah. Do you do very many do, do you do very many live appearances in the course oh, of Oh yeah. Tell I me about love I love singing live. That's why I do it. I love singing for people yeah. and I like feed off the energy and it's an adrenaline rush. And it's probably it's my favorite part of music, not even songwriting, not even just singing, but performing for people. Wait, oh, oh, there was something we were talking about before the show show started uh, that you wanted. And I said you need to tell them about that. Oh yeah. yeah. Um. So I'm in a fan voting competition for Okeechobee Music Festival, which is a big festival. Yeah. And I was selected as a finalist for their fan voting competition. And it's been a dream of mine to play there. So what, what do you mean fan voting competition? What, what do you get if you win? I get to play. OK. OK. <laughs> so so this is people that are that want you to play there. Yeah. OK. And they oh, vote yeah. for you. OK. Yes, please. So if you could vote, just go to bit.ly um, B-I-T dot L-Y slash Francesca Ani at Okeechobee. One word. Yeah, that's all one word. And if you could vote for that, that'd be really cool. And also, I'm doing a giveaway for, for people who um, vote for me. And there are 10 different prizes, and it's a lot of cool stuff, and it's a surprise. But there's a lot of um, 
cool stuff I have in the giveaway. So if you DM me a screenshot of your vote, either on Facebook or Twitter, Instagram, all at the one and Ani, the one and Ani. A and I. A and I. <laughs> so if you DM me that screenshot, then I can enter you in the giveaway and hopefully you win. Wow. And hopefully I win. So everyone wins. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, so I didn't know about this, this, uh, this, the idea about having people vote for you so you can be a part of the the festival. Yeah, it's actually pretty cool. Huh. And and is this because they they haven't heard of you or 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 you don't you don't I mean, sometimes people just say, "I want to be in the festival. Here's here's a video or me or something like that." Well, they had people submit submit to play in the festival um and submit to be in this because the festival itself is very large and they have some big bands this year like Halsey and Foster the People. Uh-huh. And they let a bunch of people submit. They said they got like 2,000 or something like oh, that. <laughs> and they picked 150, and one of them is me, Fran. And so, yeah, I would, that would be awesome so, to so, play there. So you won't get to play unless you got your people voting for you, though, huh? Exactly. Okay. Boy. The race it's is the on. It's the social media thing all over again. It, it is. It is. How much do you? Crazy. How much? What percentage of your of your time do you spend on 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 your uh, publicity and social media and stuff like that? Um, I don't want to spend as much time as I do. Probably, I want to say like thirty percent. Yeah. Just of That's my life. That's what I would have thought. You know. It's just you know staying updated and letting people know that I'm here and saying thank you for the awesome people who support me Uh and I love social media some people think it's a hassle but I love it because I know my like my biggest fans and the people who constantly like they like my posts and they're so sweet and they tell me happy new year and happy birthday and all that fun stuff It's like instant feedback from these folks yeah kind of and it's just you feel the love and I'm so grateful for everyone that sounds great well, Francesca Ani our, is our guest on today's show. She spells that uh, F-R-A-N-C-E-S-C-A-A-N-I. And you can do that all one word and put a dot com on it. Check out her website. This is the live music show on WMNF. Happens every Friday afternoon. We're going to be doing some fundraising coming up in a few weeks. And we want you to remember us when that rolls around. Support <laughs> this radio station and this radio program. If you want to get the jump on that, you can give us a call here at the station at 813-238-8001. Make a pledge of support to uh, Live Music Showcase. Or you can just go to WMNF.org and hit the tip jar and say this is for the LMS. Right? Great idea. (laughs) Let's have another song. Cool. Uh, There's not much of a story behind this one. It's actually not on any (laughs) EP or... It was it's not even going to be on the new one, but if you if you like the song, just shoot me an email, Francesca Ani at Gmail and It'll I'll make send it available. you available. Yeah. And I'll send you the MP three if you like it. But it's called Caught in the Crossfires. This ain't your bed. Lay down your arms I learn a fight on my own Not how to run No, I don't need a savior You know I tried to warn you Don't make me your enemy Cause they ain't got no mercy out there Go on, hurt me if you dare It's a war zone, love's not fair I wouldn't lie I never meant to hurt you You just got caught in the crossfires And you're playing dirty But I hate this game How can you stand and watch the ones you love 
bleed from your pain I thought that you were better I thought you'd understand that I never meant to start a war Cause they ain't got no mercy out there Go on, shoot me if you dare It's a war zone, love's not fair I wouldn't lie I never meant to hurt you You just got caught In the crossfire And I hear your gunshots I see your army on the battlefield Versus one But I ain't fighting I told you I was sorry Guess you lost all your mercy out there Take your revenge like I didn't care No, this whole thing's enough But at least I tried I never meant to hurt you You just got caught in the crossfires I never meant to hurt you You just got caught in the crossfires Yeah, Francesca Ani, our guest on today's live music showcase here from WMNF in Tampa. You can be watching this show live on Facebook if you type in LMS WMNF. And we'd like to thank our crack video crew. Bob Hope directs the whole thing. Marcy and Tom Connors and Richard Stone on cameras today. Richard Stone also double doubles as our YouTube producer. You can watch the show later on this evening. Oh, on YouTube at WMNF885FM. That's the keyword there, WMNF885FM for YouTube. Watch a bunch of our old shows, too. we got some killer shows on there, as you can imagine. We've had a <laughs> lot of great folks on here, especially in the last couple of years. Boy, some really good ones. So uh, anyway, check that out. If you want to get in touch with us at any time, Steve Arduango is our show producer. He picks the people that are going to be on the show. You can contact him at live music at WMNF.org. Well, we got about six minutes to go. I think we could squeeze in a couple of more, I hope. Yeah. I wanted to ask you when you're singing, who do you think of? Who do you who do you who, who do, do who's your of? audience? Who are you singing to? Do you have you pick like, out one person in the audience <laughs> and sing to them or um, you have an imaginary person? It uh, right now I have an imaginary person because I don't want to like stare at one person and make it kinda awkward. But, I mean, when I'm in front of, when I'm on, like, a big stage and there's tons of people, I like to make eye contact with different people and well, kind of just be like, hey, Well, I, I also you. wanted to, do you have any <laughs> gigs coming up? People come out and hear you? Um, I have a gig. I have a few, but there's a really cool one I'm doing up in Jacksonville. If any of you might be, like, passing through or you live in Jacksonville or you just want to take a road trip for a weekend, I'm doing a cool show at the Blue Jay Listening Room on Jack's Beach. And yes, I'm actually doing that. It's half a charity concert. So half of my proceeds actually go to a charity that helps people who live on Jack's Beach. Mm -hmm. okay. So if you want to come to that, that's cool. Yeah, well, they can find out more about more about all that stuff at your website. Yes, everything's mm -hmm. on my website, Facebook. FrancescaAni.com, and she spells that F-R-A-N-C-E-S-C-A-A-N-I.com. And also at... The one in Ani. <laughs> and they can find out all kinds of things. Yeah. Do you have any other interests besides your music? Do you, do you like to um, go bowling or anything? <laughs> uh, 
So I've never been a super sporty kind of gal. Well, I just threw something <laughs> out there. I didn't. No, I actually, I had, I was in gymnastics when I was younger, but I had surgery on my knee and I had a lot of surgery oh, on my foot. Too bad. So that's when I learned playing guitar. That's how I actually learned and started getting into it was because I couldn't, I couldn't move. I couldn't go anywhere. I couldn't sit on the piano bench. Oh, geez. That's, so, that's, yeah. that was a bad break. Mm. I mean, I, it was bad, but also it led me to this, which I turns out I was actually pretty awful at gymnastics, and I'm not <laughs> too bad at the whole singing thing. No, I think you had to keep on, <laughs> keep I on, might. keep on keeping on. <laughs> so what we want to do is let's sing one more song, and then uh, we'll just say goodbye, and then start, and then sing another song, and and we may fade it out on the air, but the people on Facebook will be able to hear the whole thing. Awesome, cool. Uh, so this one is actually my newest song and i've only played it for real people once by real people i mean like not my dog so we'll <laughs> see how this how this rolls it's called friends you don't have to like me you can keep your money, oh You can keep all your confessions Keep them all to yourself, we're too old for show and tell You say you're always gonna be there for me But your type of love doesn't come for free Friends don't treat you like you can be replaced and friends don't bend the truth then lie straight to your face friends don't kick you out if you don't put out for them but a friend is something that you've never been you follow like a shadow oh but your heart is just too shallow so put it in a letter Write it out just for you Don't you dare send it through If it makes you feel better You say you're always gonna be there for me But your type of love doesn't come for free Friends don't treat you like You can be replaced And friends don't bend the truth Then lie straight to your face Friends don't kick you out if you don't put out for them But a friend is something that you've never been I don't need friends like that No, I don't need friends like that No, I don't need friends like that Yeah, 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 oh, oh, yeah. I don't need friends like that I don't need friends like that no, I don't need friends like that My friends are the kind that just can't be replaced And they always make me smile, wipe the tears off my face My friends don't let me down, I do anything for them But a friend is something that you've never been and all I need in life are my real friends. Ooh, I like that song. You do? Think? I, it's very, that's it's kind of different. That's, that's a great song. Catchy, yeah. Thank you. Francesca Ani has been our guest on today's show. We've got about a minute to go. Let's start off on another song, and we'll fade it out on the air, but the folks on YouTube and, and Facebook will see the whole thing. Awesome. Thanks for coming on the show. Thank you guys so much for having me and for being so awesome. <laughs> okay, so this is called God Knows. You were never meant to stay. God didn't plan my life that way. With the simplicity of grace. Well, sometimes people change and everything changed. And I, I 
didn't crawl back to you No matter how much I wanted to No, I didn't dare to move I need somebody who's strong Strong enough to not leave And God knows it's not you I wish he told me I need somebody who knows Knows when to let me be And God knows it's not you But somebody should have told me I remember our last kiss Said it don't get better than this When I believed in you and me Well, I used to believe in anything And still I No, I didn't crawl back to you no matter how much I want to No, I can barely move And I need somebody who's strong Strong enough to not leave And God knows it's not you I wish he told me I need somebody who knows Knows when to let me be and God knows it's not you But somebody should have told me No You shouldn't promise forever Cause forever No, that's never ever true No No, you don't decide forever Forever up to you I need somebody who's strong Strong enough to not leave And God knows it's not you I wish he told me I need somebody who knows Knows when to let me be If it's so obvious to see Somebody should have told me I need somebody who's strong Stronger than me And if God knows it's not you Why the hell did he not tell